I first came to Team Movies 10 years ago to try and do Alex Huber's famous route, Bella Vista. Bella Vista goes through this huge amphitheater roof and that's what kind of first attracted me to the mountain. He said it was the biggest roof in the Alps and when I saw the pictures in the magazines, I just thought like, that is, that is it. Like it doesn't get more cool than that roof. I thought, you know, if you were going to come out and try a new route anywhere in the Alps, it would be there. So I first came out and I had a couple of abortive trips to try and do Bella Vista. Eventually, last year I managed to do Bella Vista and all the time that I spent on Bella Vista, it goes across the, uh, the left side of this roof amphitheatre, but all that time I was constantly looking across to the right hand side and I could see this amazing prow feature where the, the wall just goes out and out and out and out and out in progressively steeper roofs and there's nothing goes up that face at all. This year, I've come out to actually try and have a go at it. I've already been out for a, a kind of recce week and I tried to aid climb my way across the, the roof to just see if the lane was possible and prepare it for free climbing. But um, I ended up uh, aiding up so far and just coming across totally blank roof that wasn't possible, which is kind of what I expected, you know. I, th I thought that there would be a, a low probability of a route being possible. I don't mind, like that's that's new routing, it's just uncertain, you don't know what you're going to find. But on the last day, uh, I just went up to have a, a play on the, the top pitch on Panorama, the other route through the through that big roof. And you have to climb this big fixed rope through space to access the pitch. And from that vantage point, I could see another line that I thought might work for this new route. So now we've come back again with Alan for a few weeks. I'm trying to make as much progress on it as, as I can. I always knew that three weeks would be a ridiculously short time to try and actually get the route climbed. Both Bella Vista and Panorama, the only other two routes through that roof, took months and they were completed across different seasons. So the idea that I could do it quicker than that. Uh, in the case of perfect weather, maybe, but perfect weather we have not had. I'd only had one day working on the route, so I didn't think I was anywhere near ready to actually climb it and repoint it successfully. But we did get a brilliant break in the weather, just for a day, and so I just thought, well, I'll start at the bottom and just climb as high as I can. I expected to not even get halfway up the main pitch, because still the conditions were quite damp. When I was at the belay before the main pitch, I was saying to Alan, like, I almost don't even want to try because I just know that I'm not going to be able to, to do the pitch when it's this damp because it was worse than the previous day when I was working it. But you know, once once you start, no matter whether the conditions are good or bad, you just slip into trying hard mode. <laughs> and so I just completely went for it. I can't believe I got to the pitch, it was soaking as well. Yes! Come on. To the top. <laughs> 